Welcome back to my channel, Smoking and Grilling and Cooking with me, A.B. Today's video is a treat for you. This is going to be the Krispy Kreme Smash Burgers. I'm going to show you how to make a good Smash Burger. And then, when, you know, for the bun, we're going to go ahead and use Krispy Kreme glazed donuts. Hey, this right here is outstanding. If you never, ever tried it, you got to try it at least once in your life. Listen, first time I had it, it blew my mind back. Now I make them all the time, so I thought I'd share it with everybody. Hey, and another thing, too. Look, we're going to do Smash Burgers. If you've never done a smash burger before, this is going to be interesting. Because you know what? When we cook uh, patties, we always say, well, especially when we're on the grill, things like this, we always say, never, ever push your patty and smash it down. But here, I'm going to show you. When you're making a smash burger, look, the trick is, once you roll your ball up, your meat up, and you get it into a ball, you put it in your skillet, listen, you smash it down then before it can release all of the flavors, you know, the juice, uh, the fat, the flavor. You smash it down. What you're doing is you're searing the meat. You're getting it real nice and thin so the edges, are, you know, it'd be nicely crusted. And that right there is the uh, secret. But you got to do it when you first, you know, start it. So what I do is put it in, smash it. I hold it down for about 10 seconds. After that, I let it up and I let it cook. And then you want to use something uh, sort of a, a high heat. I like to see my pan smoking a little bit. It lets me know that I got it right. It's searing and it's cooking and it forms that crust right, you know, right around the edge. So with no further ado, let's get it in. <music> 